make sure to stay until the end we will share a very guys very good secret how to find engine noise wine hey guys welcome back thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel today will be super helpful video to any of you guys having a car and when you start it makes a whining noise from the engine stay with us we'll explain how to find out what's causing that all that guys will be covered in this video today make sure to stay until the end we'll share a secret how we can easily uh, actually isolate noises and find the right one before we start let me just tell you a little bit about us guys every single car we get here at the garage we try to make at least two to three hundred free repair videos why we guys do that because our mission here at the garage is to save you guys as much money as we can all we need guys in return please subscribe to the channel like the video that way we can keep making these free videos we're constantly getting new cars we're constantly working on stuff to save you money now if you need to buy any parts tools at a really good price and quick shipping check out the link in the description of the video below that's where we get all our two supplies from as well so let's go ahead explain first we'll show you guys okay uh, we'll, we'll show you what noise it makes okay when we start the car without removing anything and then we'll show you a secret so we're going to go ahead and demonstrate what that noise wine sounds like okay from the pulley so let's go ahead start it now okay you're going to hear it it will sound like really annoying you sound it coming from the top end here guys it almost sounds like a, something's bad inside the engine okay so let's give it gas Long. so you can definitely guys hear it and the warmer it gets the louder it gets as well so let's explain what causes that now so you hear guys that Mercedes with the engine noise whine okay when we had the belt on and everything else so we want to show you now guys okay how we can find that problem what we did here we removed the serpentine belt check on some vehicles how long that belt will be guys it's extremely long and you wonder why due to the fact that you have power steering pump that's driven by the belt tensioner pulley AC compressor crankshaft pulley water pump idler pulley on top we have another right work pulley here okay we have the alternator right there guys that's the alternator there and we have water pump as well all these things are driven by the belt so what uh, usually can cause wine and noise it could be very often bad power steering pump it could be bad ac compressor pulley okay or bad ac compressor it could be tensioner pulley guys quite often that's a tensioner pulley two idler pulleys okay that's where actually our problem is in these pulleys and it could be even a failing alternator or, or alternator uh, bearing that creates that noise so we'll remove the belt and we'll start the car for only about up to 15 seconds so let's see if it's making a noise now with the belt removed so we can uh, isolate that noise and find out what's causing it guys so let's go ahead start it now okay and you can guys here okay that noise is practically gone guys so our problem is somewhere here we did some research uh, we checked the power steering we make sure that okay uh, car battery is disconnected and stuff like that because the fan can turn on at any time okay and it can get your fingers but right here we move the pulley for the ac compressor the alternator we spun and everything looks fine water pump and this is weak spot usually on cars guys when you replace serpentine belts you always need to replace your idler pulleys and tensioner pulley as well that's our problem i had here that's what was causing the noise hopefully the video will be helpful to any of you having that thank you for watching and see you guys next time